Hi guys, welcome back to another video. For today's video, I am super duper excited because I can finally try the Pattern Beauty styling products. So I'm not gonna lie, I've had the Pattern Beauty products for quite some time. I went ahead and purchased them from Ulta myself and I've had them and I haven't had the chance to try them. But today we're gonna go ahead and try them because I do have to style my hair. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm Noelia, I talk about all things curly. So if you're interested in learning how these products work in my hair, don't forget to like this video. Subscribe to my channel, turn on the alerts so you know when I post my next video, and I will drop my social handles so you guys could follow me on there as well, and keep on watching. Alrighty, so my hair is freshly washed, conditioned. I actually, today, I did a hot oil treatment, which I haven't done in quite some time, but my hair needed that extra, extra moisture, so that's what we did today. My hair feels super soft, moisturized, hydrated, all of that, thank God. Okay guys, so for today's video, I'm actually gonna be testing out the Pattern Beauty Styling Cream and the Pattern Beauty Stronghold Gel. I actually love the packaging of this. It's so cute, it's like a little face. I've heard some mixed reviews on the products. I'm not entirely sure how it's gonna work in my hair, but I hope that it turns out okay. So I actually haven't even opened them or tested them or anything, so let's find out. Of course, we're gonna start off with the styling cream. Let's just see what it looks like. I like that they come sealed. We love to see it. Let me just pop this open. I always struggle to get these open because my nails, they're such an awkward length, so I just can't even. All right, this might be, anyone else struggle to open these? Just gives me an indication that this might be a thick product because I think it's sticking to the product. Oh, ooh, got it. Okay, so this is what it looks like. All right, seems kind of thick. So this is the consistency. Yeah, she's pretty thick. So I'm kind of excited. Ooh, she smells super light. Ooh, I love the smell, very light. It smells super light and refreshing and it's not too overbearing. So let's go ahead and part my hair. I'm gonna put this in my hair right now since it's already on my hands. Let's see what it feels like. Let's see. Can't really tell, I feel like that's not enough to judge, but let's see. I think I'm gonna take small sections for this product review because I feel like it's better to work that way, especially when it's with a new product. So I'm gonna section my hair off like so. Take sections like this if you like they're pretty decent sized. All right, so since it is a pretty thick product, I think I'm gonna go with like this amount. Let's try that, hopefully it's not too much. Let's see. Okay. Okay, so first impression so far, feels soft in my hair has a lot of slip, for sure. Okay, as you rake it in more, I feel like it gives you more slip. My hair is like drinking it up. All right, let me grab my flexi brush and just brush that through. And then we'll see what it looks like. I feel like it's gonna cut my curls really well. Let's see. Oh. Okay, this is without gel. We're not mad at that. The light might be a little off in my room because this is not my typical filming room. I just figured I would switch it up for today's video just because I have no actual reason why. Just decided to switch it up a little bit. All right, so now that that's in my hair, I'm gonna go ahead and grab, let me just make sure this is on. I'm gonna grab the gel. So this is what it looks like. I actually showed you guys what the cream one looks like. All right, here we go, my hands are slippery. Okay, we got that open. Same top, so it's also sealed, we love to see it. Just figure out how to pop this open. I am like terrible, oh, here it is. Okay. Ooh, the gel looks pretty thick as well. Interesting. So this is the consistency of the gel. Okay. Feels, smells just like the cream. Very light scent, nothing too aggressive or too overbearing. 
So I'm going to apply some of the gel right on top and see how it goes. Okay, they feel really, really nice together. Add a little bit more of the gel. So I am a heavy handed gal when it comes to adding products because I just like to make sure that my hair is evenly coated so I can get my optimal definition and moisture. And then I'm gonna brush it through. Okay. All right, so it feels really nice in my hair. Ooh. Definitely here for the results so far. Seems like it's gonna give me a light hold. Nothing too, too aggressive. It seems like it's gonna be a soft hold is what I mean, not a light hold. I feel like it's, they're pretty clumped for the most part. All right, let's go on with the next section. Add some of the cream. The cream has a lot of slip. All right, you know what? I have been such a lazy styler and I know that it's better for me to style my hair with water, but I'm such a lazy styler. So I've just been like, I just make it work, you know? I'm gonna go ahead and grab my water bottle because I should not be lazy. When you have low porosity hair, it's so important to actually add water to your styling products, not directly to the product, but in your hair while you're styling because I feel like it helps the product get into your hair. So, I need to be better with that. Okay, so I'm back. I typically use the aerosol spray water sprayer thing for my hair. I feel like it helps get my hair saturated. Only thing is that this one doesn't actually like really stop. It does stop, but it takes quite some time for it to actually stop. All right, cool. Yeah, it looks, that feels a lot better. I'm just such a lazy styler these days. I don't know what has been going on with me, but I know better and I know that adding water to my styling routine definitely helps, so I'm gonna be better. Alrighty, so that's in. I'm gonna grab some of the gel, like so, and just apply that directly to my hair as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and style the rest of my hair the same exact way. I'm gonna start with the styling cream and then follow up with the Stronghold Gel. And then I will show you guys my results at the end. But I'm just gonna speed through the rest of this video. You guys know the drill. I don't want you guys to sit and watch me style my hair for the whole video. So I'm gonna speed through it and then show you guys my final wet results. Alright guys, so my hair is fully styled using the two Pattern Beauty products and I'm actually impressed so far. It is, like I said, a lighter hold than my typical wash and go routines, but it feels like it's going to give me great results because even with the light hold, I feel like it already has a lot of definition, so really, really excited about that. But to touch up on the products, the styling cream, guys, a little goes such a long way. Let me show you guys how much I actually used. Like. Hold on, I gotta see if it will focus. Look how much I actually used from this product. Like, a little goes a long way. I barely used any of the cream and it lathered up really, really well and it gave me so much slip. So I really do like that you don't have to use too much to get great results. Actually, let's see once my hair is dry, but just getting the product throughout my hair, I only had to use that much and I still feel like I used a lot of products. So, with that said, I do like that a little does go a long way because 
that means you get what you pay for. These aren't the most affordable, but if you can use this much per wash and go, then I'm not mad at it. If you can use this much for your wash and go, this just goes to show that you're getting your money's worth, which I absolutely love. So let's see how my hair dries. And as far as the gel, so I did go a little bit more overboard on the gel. You guys can see how much I used. I want to say I used a decent amount. There's a lot left in there. You can't really tell because it's not dark like the cream is, which is clear, so you can't really tell. So I did use a decent amount, but I do have enough for like three more wash and goes. If it's this, if this was enough gel, then I have enough for about three wash and goes, which is not too bad. The price again is not the cheapest, but it does give me a light, soft hold. So if it gives me some bomb results, then I definitely would repurchase this product. I do like how soft it is and it doesn't feel like it's going to leave any crunch. So I'm going to go ahead and diffuse my hair and then I'll show you guys how my hair turns out. But so far I really do like the two products. So let's see how it dries. Um, hello, pattern beauty. Um, I'm shook. I'm sh guys, are you guys seeing this? This. I was not expecting this. I Okay, so I was expecting good results, but guys, this is fuego. And my hair is 80% dry right now. It's not like 100% dry because I just didn't want to wait to show you guys this. But this, I love it. On top of using these products, I did do a hot oil treatment and I did use the Bomba Curls deep conditioner as well. But these two products did what they had to do. I am so impressed. My hair feels so soft. I don't even have to scrunch out any crunch. It's just so soft. The curls are so pretty. What I would say is my front area is a little bit frizzy, but it's nothing that I'm not used to. I feel like my front area naturally just gets more frizzy than the rest of my hair, and I couldn't tell you why. Do you guys see that? You guys are gonna think I'm crazy because I feel like on camera it doesn't actually reflect the frizz. But all in all, wow. Pattern Beauty came through. Damn, Tracy Ellis Ross, girl. Like, look at, are we looking? Are, guys, I'm so happy. Shout out to Pattern Beauty, those styling cream and the Stronghold Gel, must have. So if you've thought about getting them, get them. I mean, this is only day one, so I don't know how they're gonna hold up, but I have a good feeling about it. I feel like it's gonna last. All in all, let's just look at these results again. All the shine, definition, holes but yeah like it's just free and soft and fluffy and bouncy like I'm here for this I'm so here for this I love a successful wash and go there's no feeling like it so yeah these two highly recommend them again this is only day one so I don't know how they're gonna hold up but so far absolutely love them it gave me some bomb results and I didn't even use a lot of product I'm actually really impressed with the product payout, I don't know if that's an actual term, but I just, just made that up. I'm thinking makeup. I'm thinking makeup, you know, like when you use a product and it has a good color payout, I'm always assuming product payout, you know what I mean. Anyways, I am very impressed with the product payout and how a little goes a long way with these products. So definitely recommend them if you've thought about getting them. They do have smaller sizes that you can actually test out. I just never know how much is going to be enough. Since I have so much, I decided to just get the full size bottle and if I didn't like it, whatever, I'd give it away. But I'm so happy that I picked these up because I absolutely love them and I will use these again for my next wash and go because they were bomb. But yeah guys, that is all for today's video. I hope you guys liked my Pattern Beauty review and if you did, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. If you have any questions regarding anything from this wash and go, anything in general, just go ahead and comment them down below. But that is all for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video.